Hi, it's Rob Shapiro from Technique Peak. Today we're going to talk about lumbar instability tests. So one is a prone lumbar extension test. The good thing about it, the sensitivity of the test is around 88%. That means it's really good to rule out. So that means 88% of the people who have it will have a positive sign. What we're going to do is patient lies straight. It's kind of a little tough on the patient, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to lift their legs. I'm going to do a little bit of traction so their knees stay straight. I'm going to lift their legs, they say 30 centimeters, which for us is 12 inches, which is probably that big. And as I do that, I'm looking for their symptoms, and that would be positive. They do have those symptoms positive for instability, functional clinical instability. So relax there, you don't do anything. I'm going to do a little bit of traction so his knees stay straight, and I'm just going to lift his legs about 12 inches off the table, come back down. Any low back pain? No. Negative. Yes, I have that back pain that causes my same pain. That would be a positive lumbar prone uh, extension test. Rob Shapiro from Technique Peak.